So today we're making a bread, avocado, and egg with, ew, egg with seed sandwich. So it's not really a sandwich. Toast. So if you want to know how to make that, super easy. Just keep watching. See, my ingredients are avocado, two eggs, preferably on what you want, chia seeds, and toast, which is already in the toaster, which ooh, I will be doing later. So I'm just going to cut this already. Oh, I cut it wrong, but that way when I <laughs> that way when I put it in my that way it's ready for my toast. Oh my gosh, I cut this so wrong. Look at this, guys. Okay. Well, so first things first, I like to put oil of course in and you'll probably hear my dog in um the pan. Not too much. I don't know. Maybe that was much. And then I just like to go like this. And so I just let that heat. It heats pretty fast. So I just take my egg. You roll these down because it's not trying to get burnt. And I'm making it like semi fried, I guess. You. Your egg should kind of start looking like this. So we're just letting it go crispy and then I throw in my salt which could have been a lot and I like a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot of pepper on my egg. I feel like it gives it more flavor. I personally don't like the yolk so I just take the knife that I use from avocado and I just spill it like so. Sometimes I like to add garlic powder, just, I don't know, just cause, and then it'll mix once I flip it, but usually I do this right in the beginning, and then paprika, I don't know why, I feel like it doesn't really do anything, but I just do it, I hate this lid. So my egg is cooking real nice and now I'm just going to flip it and it's not going to be cute because I'm really bad at flipping. And then I just like to pour pepper on the back as well because I really like pepper and not too much salt even though it looks like a lot, it's not. Then in here, two shots of vodka. And then I take it off and it looks like crazy, but it's really good. So sometimes if I like the runniness, because there will be a little bit of runniness. I'll eat it like that, which is also very good, but sometimes it grosses me out, so today I don't think I'll eat it with the runniness. Maybe a little bit, but not too much. And I'm just using 100% whole wheat bread. Okay, so now my toast is done. I'm just gonna grab it out of here. And there's my cat on the roof. So, like I said, I cut the avocado weird. So I'm just gonna, ooh, scoop this out. Ah! <laughs> just spread this on my bread. I like to put a lot, but up to you because I don't know. I like to actually use the whole thing. If you want you grab your chia seeds, chai, I don't know what these are, sesame seeds. Oh my gosh, I have this thing wrong. And just, oh, I poured a lot. Okay, so basically I'm just gonna 
spread this around. You can kind of see them. But yeah, you'll do that. And then you'll add your egg. You. Okay. And then it kind of looks like this. Sometimes I like to throw a little more avocado on top. I know it's a lot of avocado. Ew, what? Okay. There was like a mini seed from the big seed, which is weird. Um, oh my gosh. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I sometimes I like to, ew, <laughs> add a little extra avocado. Oh my gosh. Um, on top. Because I feel like it makes it taste a little bit better. It's like an avocado sandwich. So I just... Well, this one's not spreading as easy because it's like the seed part, but I just throw it on top. And then this is what you should get. It looks gross, but it's really good. And it's semi-healthy because, I mean, you use egg yolk and salt and oil, but... I mean, you could use coconut oil and all that stuff, but anyways, yeah, this is how you cook or make at least this type of breakfast. It's really good. So I know I look really bad, but if you liked my video, please give it a thumbs up, like it, and subscribe. Follow me on my Instagram, which is Salty Sab. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think, if there's anything else you want me to try to cook, and um... Yeah. Bon appétit.